My name is Ken and today I will show you how to turn a messenger bag into a camera bag. You can obviously go out and buy a, a camera bag to put your gear in but for me I like to use what I already have and for me I have two bags. I have this uh, messenger bag that I use quite frequently. It's um, used for putting in my laptop uh, some papers and pens and stuff that I use to bring to work and I'll put my lunch in there sometimes but when I go and sh uh, shoot I want a camera bag to carry my camera and lenses and accessories and stuff. So uh, instead of going out and buying another bag for that purpose, I wanted to reuse this. So the way to do it is to get some sort of camera padding or insert, right? So this bag is a, a typical messenger bag. It's made out of denim or, or canvas and it's branded William Rast. I didn't really care what brand it was, but when I googled William Rast, it's a company uh, founded by Justin Timberlake, if you're interested to know that. Um, like I said, it's a very simple bag. I liked it for the style and the price, and uh, that's why I got it. So to make, turn this into a messenger bag, you're going to need some sort of uh, padding. You can obviously put your camera gear in here, but the problem is there's, no, there's not a lot of padding, and there's no like real dividers for lenses and stuff and all your gear is just gonna bounce around and get damaged right this is a uh, some padding camera padding that you can buy I uh, found one on eBay for about twenty dollars there's actually a bunch of them on eBay that you can buy they range in price from five dollars all the way up to you know a uh, hundred dollars um, it depends on the, the brand and the size of it this one is um, actually pretty good this one I like because you can expand or collapse it by just pulling apart the velcro. So it can expand from 10 centimeters uh, wide to 17 centimeters. And uh, it already has the dividers in here. As you can see, I already have um, some of my gear in here already. I don't shoot with really big cameras. So this is my EM5. So. I can fit a lot of gear. I can usually fit two camera bodies in here, like my next Sony Next cameras, um, my EM5. I can fit a charger, some batteries, uh, some camera straps, and a few lenses. So that's usually what I have inside my camera bag. I don't carry a whole lot, and it fits in this little uh, padded camera case. So we're going to put this in the messenger bag and show you what it looks like. So here's the messenger bag. Like I showed you before, the main compartment's here. There is a compartment here for a laptop, but we're going to put it into the main compartment. So when you buy these padded inserts, they come in different shapes and sizes, obviously, and you, um, you can look for the, uh, make sure that it's the right size. And it, the description will usually tell you how big they are. And this one fits perfectly inside. So all you do is you just shove it in here, and that is it. Now it becomes a messenger slash camera bag, just like that. And when you put the flap over it, like I said, I like reusing it. This is one of my favorite camera bags, and I like using it to carry my um, work equip, my work stuff as well as uh, my camera stuff when I'm shooting. So the great thing about this insert is that it will fit in other bags as well. So when I bought this, I made sure that it will fit in my other bag as well and I'm going to show you that right now. This is just to show you how versatile this padding is. So the other bag that I own is this Targus laptop bag. Uh, it's designed to hold a 17 inch uh, laptop. Inside here as well is a padded area for your laptop. But the problem with it is of course is that it's not divided and you, when you put your camera gear in there it'll just basically move around and possibly get damaged. There is a lot of padding on this too because it's designed specifically for laptops. Like there's padding down here on the sides and stuff. So it's fairly insane but it doesn't have any dividers so we're gonna put the same divider that I got for the other bag in here so 
So this bag is a little bit tighter, but it fits into that. So it's in there, and I'm usually pulling these flaps back like this. So now it's in there. So just like before, this is now a camera bag. And this one has a lot more compartments than the denim canvas bag that I had before. This one has uh, pockets for uh, a whole bunch of stuff and there's pockets on the side for um, a water bottle and, and other things like that. And internally there's zippers, there's zippered compartments for your tablet and um, other accessories, cables and stuff. So I like this bag. It's very, it's very uh, professional looking. I use this as well as a camera bag. So that just shows you how versatile that insert is. I recommend that you do something like this instead of having a dedicated camera bag. Uh, I don't particularly like having a lot of bags uh, lying around my place, so um, if I can reuse something, it's always good. If you need a bag to carry your uh, camera equipment. Think about you know maybe reusing something you already have and getting some padding for it.